Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Gia. Welcome to my channel or if you're from here, welcome back to my channel. So this weekend I had the pleasure of going to the awesome, the amazing Playlist Live in Orlando, Florida. If you guys know me, you know I love traveling, I love meeting people, I love meeting friends, all that stuff. So this trip was so amazing for me to go. Honestly, this experience was something just really different that I've never really experienced. It was just so like... I don't know, adventurous, and it was so fun beginning to end. So the weekend was way more hectic than I thought it would be. I thought I'd have more time to just like sit down, but no, your bitch was on her feet 24-7. So with that, I ended up not filming anything, not even the vlog, which I really regret because there was a lot of videos I was gonna film, and I just like didn't end up getting to it, you know? So since I didn't film anything, I thought I would just kind of film my experience and talk about it with you guys and just do that and if you are wondering now i think i am gonna go to playlist next year just because i had such a good experience and i kind of know what to expect now so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna go again next year okay so i really don't know where to start so i guess i'll just like break everything into different sections and talk about different things so the first thing the hotel the hotel was huge there was so many people like i wasn't expecting that many people to be there like the lobby was literally packed the whole hotel was just packed all the time especially friday and saturday there was just so much going on and it was way bigger than i expected like i expected like a big hotel you know but i wasn't expecting like this huge thing like it was just it was huge like the pool that thing was huge like i felt like i had to walk across like three acres just get from like one side to the other it was literally massive okay now let's move on to the people so the people I don't really know like what I'm gonna talk about in this um my room was packed I stayed with eight people um so lesson learned I'm not doing that ever again because that was just way too much for me I love everyone that I stayed with but it was just way too much going on especially in a little tiny room it was way too much so I'm not doing that ever again the people at playlist creators fans etc um I met a lot of people that I knew from Twitter or Instagram and that was so nice to like put at names with faces and all that. Creator wise, I met a lot of my favorite people. Uh, Sam Collins is one of them. He's one of the like only YouTubers that I watch. I watch him and just a few other people so it was really cool to meet up with him and all that. Sarah Baska is another person that I really really love watching. I've only been watching her videos for a couple months now but I absolutely like love her personality and just her overall and I ran into her when we were walking like by the lobby and all that and we ran into her and she's just the sweetest person ever. I love her so much. Tina Woods, I love her. I finally got to meet her after not meeting her so many times. Andrea Russett, literally the reason why I do YouTube. She's literally my inspiration and my reasoning as to why I wanted to start a channel. And funny because we're both from Indiana, we're both brunettes, we're both YouTubers, like, like we're pretty much the same person. I went to a press play meetup and I saw the Juarez twins, who I love. Uh, Sebastian Lozanski, who I've known for a couple years now, and I finally got to meet him. I love him, too. I met people from the vlog squad, and I don't watch them. Like, I just literally have just started watching them, and I've kind of, like, known who they were because people would always talk about them, and everyone that I roomed with was, like, fans of them and watched them, except for me. And we ended up meeting Zane, Heath, Tati, and Corinna. I didn't meet David. He ended up leaving early on, like, Sunday, I think. And, yeah, it was... A good time some other people I don't know I had really mixed feelings about playlists like people wise because some of the people that I met were super genuine and just you know themselves and then there were others where they were just super fake and you can kind of feel it like there were people walking around that they thought they were better than others which obviously no one's better than anyone else Especially if you're not a creator. If you're not a creator at Playlist and you're walking around like you're the shit, like you need to get your head out of your ass because you're not better than anybody. Like there were people walking around that maybe have like a kind of big following, you know, like obviously bigger than mine, but maybe they have like 60k, like that kind of range, you know, and they're walking around like they were like Obama or something like, sweetie, no, you're not Obama. You're not Justin Bieber. 
get your head out of there and just be a normal person like everybody else because you're really not better than anyone besides from the fake people everyone else there they just seemed like really fun they were enjoying themselves and i just thought like it was pretty good but then again wherever you go like anywhere you go you're always gonna have the people that are fake and then the ones that are real and you just kind of have to figure it out so now actual playlist event wise personally i don't really know if it was worth it if it was not because okay so the two meetups i went to was press play i picked that one because it was just kind of people that i knew and i just wanted to see again and then the other one was people i didn't know at all so i ended up not going to my sunday meetup because i didn't know anybody and that meetup was kind of like a last minute because the one that I wanted which was um, Tana and Sarah got sold out so I just kind of had to get it you know just kind of like I don't know what else to do so I didn't really like the fact that in the meetups it's a line and you gotta meet everyone because not everyone is there for everyone and it just felt kind of awkward and it feels forced because I don't like force talking to people that maybe i don't like or i don't know because i feel awkward and the whole like line thing i feel so rushed i like sitting down and making connection with people so that's probably just one reason i didn't like that one thing i did like though was the panels i thought those were like really interesting like aside from the meetups the different panels that they have like the one i went to was with andrew rustin there were a couple other like uh i think they were all youtubers or something like that and they were talking about like how hard it is for girls to do YouTube and like how they kind of like rose up and all that and I thought that was something really like inspirational and something really good for me to watch because I do YouTube too and I want to know how to get better at it and all that stuff so I thought the panels were a really good thing and it's just something kind of like little extra thing so you can get to see the people that you care about even more plus that was before I met Andrea so like when I went to her panel, I thought that was, like, as much as I was going to get seeing her. And then I ended up saying, like, one thing to her on her way out, and that was it. So I was like, oh, that's it. Like, that's all I'm going to get from Andrea. But then I ended up actually, like, meeting her and talking to her later, like, during the weekend. So little things like the panels, they really do, like, a lot, you know? There was a pool party, which I didn't swim, which I kind of regret not swimming because coming here, it's cold and I can't swim here. So I kind of wish I did, especially when it was like almost 90. Ooh. <coughs> Ooh. My bad. So like I kind of do regret not swimming because the weather was so nice. And I think I got like a little bit of a tan, like barely. But I'm a little bit darker than I was, like at least my face, but you can't see it because I have makeup on. But my face is a little bit more tan, so I think I did something with that. The pool party was really cute, like the music and all that, it was funny, like it was a good time. And I celebrated my birthday, which is tomorrow, because today's Thursday, and tomorrow's my birthday. But I never get to celebrate it with anyone on my actual birthday because all my friends live kind of far from me and I can never drive over there and all that. So I celebrated my birthday, which was nice. I mean, yeah, overall, it was a really good experience. I definitely would do it again. It was so much fun. I made a lot of friends. I met people that I knew. I just had overall, like, a lot of adventures and just a lot of, like, memories that I'll never be able to, like, forget. And they're memories that I don't know if I'd be the same if... I didn't experience the memories and I, I don't know overall it was just so amazing and it was something super different to experience and I'm really thankful for it so hopefully with playlist next year I'm continuing on this YouTube grind I'm continuing on my content on everything so we can build up and thrive sooner rather than later with that being said it really means everything to me to people that watch my videos are subscribed keep up with my instagram and twitter and all that like it really means so much to me because i love youtube and social media with all my heart and it would just mean everything for me to be able to be a creator next year at playlist so it's really up to you guys to help me out and watch my stuff and be supportive and share it like i cannot ask that enough that's that's all i want is just love and support from everyone that watches my videos so with that being said please share this video if you liked it and also give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and turn on my post notice you can also check out my social media below it's always linked in the description and that is it guys i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you next week peace out